So, um, um, so today, um, I noticed that, um, a lot of, um, um, people were, um, arriving or like hanging out at like um the presidio area and i think like um it's like it's uh it's, it's okay but the thing is like it's usually like a really quiet like neighborhood but like um yeah i i mean i feel like um a lot of like people are like trying to like um um go to like this area like um to try to find like um a piece of heaven in presidio but really it's just near like the golden gate bridge and what you get like at the presidio is basically a lot of like um as of natives, um, from, <coughs> like, um, food, like, Sonoma, like, county, like, residents living there, and most of them are really, um, really 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 like um low tempered um and not like easy to get along with um especially if um you don't really like talk to them that much but i know that like um a pharmacist used to say like you should exchange but when I don't have that much from the beginning, it's really difficult, like, um, to exchange with someone. But I think, like, what is going on is, um, like, I, I feel like, um, Presidio in general, like, um, the area is, like, um, really, um, help, like, I, I don't know. Like, the kids are, like, really, like, um, like, they're, like, um, grew up with, like, Berkeley, like, teachers, and they just do not, like, really, um, know how to talk, like, better than the teachers and like I guess like for young age you really don't know how to really talk back but I feel like a lot of like the people there are like poisoning not poisoning like they're forcing them to say certain things to attack my like um character but it's like a thing where you have to deal with the fact that when you're a secret like um relationship with someone it's like difficult that i don't really like talk to like other people about it unless if like someone i've known for a while and that i can be like basically like um can talk to but like in the end like um in the end like, I feel like a lot of people just don't like people, like, not, um, like, openly dating in front of, like, um, others in the Presidio. So, it's like, they have this thing where, like, well, if you have, like, a fiancé or, like, a husband or, like, whatnot, um fiance 
um why is he not like with you all the time and why are you always alone it's like a thing where like i have to be really stable on my own like since i have mental health issues um before i can really like bring him like to other people or hang out and i don't think it's a good idea for like mental illness people to date openly because like i feel like once you hang out like together like as a couple like people will try to like um steal him f away from me and i don't really want to deal with like the consequences so it's like i think like um the presidio pool is like um trying to see if they can steal like other people's like husbands like asian husbands but like i feel like at the same time like they're really like not able to find any like good looking and like eligible bachelors who like um don't want like more than one relationship unless if like forced to do so so it's a thing where you have to watch out for offending these type of like women who date like ordinary men who are five seven or five five who really don't have like much of a background and it's a thing it's an ongoing thing that i have to fight with and i've been getting like white hair um just thinking about like trying to like defend for like my fiance and me relationship it's like um how should i say this like when it's like not like um serious i and like close to the point where it's like wedding day i don't really like um want to like introduce him to you guys so it's like you guys have been like seeing him like secretly behind like my back and he's not really going to like just because you guys like have an independent secret or like um relationship doesn't mean that he's going to fall for you guys because like it's like a, a thing where like um when a relationship doesn't get exposed there's a reason you're trying to protect it it's like kind of a celebrity thing um when you're doing youtube especially like when you're like facing like a large amount of audience like when you like talk about your relationship with so many people they're not going to sympathize with you and they're not not sympathize but they're not going to really like care that much all they want is just to damage the relationship because they don't have like a good relationship with their significant other themselves so like I mean, I'm not going to just, like, tell you, like, where he's at or, like, may allow you guys to track him down through GPS, like, all the time. Because, like, it's, like, a big, like, um, it's not big, but, like, it's really, like, I don't know, like, I, I don't know, like, what's the term for it, but, like, like women who steal other people's boyfriends when like the boy like doesn't like introduce himself to them um it's like it's like really really um annoying to the point where like um i don't understand how else to say this but like just leave him alone because he doesn't want like anyone from like mid like twenties who are not like from a really good like college. Like by good college I mean at least like a UC or like at least at least like making at least like twenty dollars an hour or fifteen dollars an hour instead of like 
just like working like I don't know like what you call it like you, you you work like temp or like you work at home and then you don't have like a good income source of income to like make yourself like really a stable like person so even if you are a stable income maker it's like um probably not going to last that long because like he doesn't like people who like chases him and if you don't have anything better than him then I don't know what to say just go back to like college or something